Well, uh, here she is. She's a little bit better, but uh, with the medication, the steroids, she has a collapsed trachea. She's not doing too hot. Um, I think she's been standing to uh, stay cool. Her back legs aren't moving very well. The foots are pointed outward. She's lost about a pound, which is good, but uh, still a little bit overweight. Not as bloated, but she is moving around a little bit. Um, still has pneumonia. I got okay, so... Um, you saw a little clip of uh, her um, still having some XLR microphone problems. I hate turning off the mics on the um, cameras because somehow that's interfering with the Streamer X. And I don't know if it's a software update from Ecamm Live, you know, with the, uh, you know, with the Elgato cam links with the streamer x i don't know so i just got it on mute don't have to worry about it i can still play sounds but um basically i'm just using this for you know the video it's a free 4k uh video station but uh anyhow so this is the uh fx30 A7S3, S9. And with the S9, it's the 20 uh, millimeter wide focal view that I want to show you. How sharp and clear it is. Just as long as I don't put the lights on my eyes, I won't come out of focus like this. That's doing pretty good now. But, uh, I just want to give you an update of what's been going on with my channel. As you can see, last Saturday I took uh, my dog to the emergency vets. Uh, they did some x-rays. She had a collapsed trachea, which caused pneumonia. And uh, it's Friday, almost a week since I've been there. I've been to my vets. Uh, she was um, spitting out certain medications, so I um, turned one into uh, a liquid form, which is easier with the shot, giving it through her mouth, than it is uh, trying to give her a pill. Because you, I mix it with the food. She's eating good again. She was walking better yesterday, but... Now she's slowing down again, which I'm getting worried. Uh, my vets, they're open a half a day tomorrow on Saturday. So I don't want to make another run to the emergency clinic this weekend. So I think uh, she is eating. She is resting a lot. Um... Been trying to get her to walk as much as possible. So I'll get up, she'll follow me around, which is a good thing. Um, been thinking of doing yard work, but I haven't been doing anything because of her condition. So that has kind of stopped my what I want to do. But what I am going to do, and you'll be seeing the video shortly, uh, the 6K comparison of cameras uh, down sample to 4k compared to the 8k cameras down sample to 4k and then we'll see which resolution you'll like better uh, the only other news front is uh, I'm still waiting for some Viltrox 28 millimeter lens which they shipped standard so that means instead of airplane they put it by ship 
and then it has to go to customs. So I might get it next month or later this month. Uh, the tracking is at shipping and that's it. Uh, no emails or anything. I just have to do some investigative work through the back door to find out, you know, what's happening. Um, election is over. Uh, but I am getting more spam. <laughs> and uh, uh, the only other thing I can say is I did order an M4. And uh, when I get it, I'll do a proper unboxing. Uh, I already unboxed the keyboard and uh, mouse. And uh, they're already charged, ready to go. Uh, I compared the M4 Mac Mini to the M4 iMac. And with the iMac, uh, they do have a 16 gigabyte. 512 gigabyte SSD, but where where would I put the computer? I'm limited in space. I got if, if you know me, I got computers all around the house. Okay, I did get rid of another computer. I'm thinking of getting rid of two more. It's uh, the AMD um, uh, Ryzen Thread Ripper. Uh, 2900X with 64 gigs of RAM. And I'm thinking of getting rid of the um, i9 3950X uh, uh, threat, you know, um, Ryzen. And that one I think has only 32 gigs of RAM. But uh, they both have uh, RTX 2080 Ti's. I'll get rid of those. Uh, the 2900X is very quiet, stays cool. Uh, the 3950X is a little bit more, is a little bit louder, but still, they both have LED lights. Uh, they're great computers. Uh, they'll bring me down to three PCs. This little bitty one right here. Um, I might get rid of that and put the Mac Mini over here or on this one. I uh, moved one of the computers or the Mac Mini from here to the bedroom so I can have a Mac in there if I decide to do a live stream. So I added this TV, uh, 40 inch 4K with this system. So now I got a two monitor system. So that, that's what's been going on. Uh, you should be seeing the comparisons pretty shortly. Um, if I do a share right now, just to show you what I've got. This is the picture quality from um, the 4K. And this is one of the original 4K TVs that I got. I had two of these. I gave one to a neighbor. And then I got rid of a, another one. So basically, it's uh, OLED TVs I have now. I do have some regular LCDs or LED backlights, whatever. This one, that one, and one in the closet. Yeah, because the other one's an OLED also. So they're still sharp. They're cheaper now. Uh... If you can get one that's 120 hertz, um, get one with good picture quality. All LEDs tend to have all black, but many LEDs are good. Uh, what I would suggest is when you're using the mouse, you don't, you don't want to see any blinking when I move the mouse. You don't want to see any uh, trailing effect. Okay? And I don't know if you can see that right now. You're probably not. I don't see it on the monitor. But, uh, yeah, I don't see it. So I'm not showing it right now, which is a good thing. But uh, that's the monitor. I um, just want to say uh, thank you for watching.
I'm trying to remember where I am. Is it? Yeah. Day 7 is 3. Okay? So thank you for watching. Remember, stay safe. Keep smiling. I will see you next time. I'm hoping that you'll get better. And uh, hopefully the next time that I have one of these uh, live updates, uh, I'll have some good news. Bye, folks. Have a wonderful day.